Well, I'm back, and I really haven't done that many side jobs, unfortunately, so I still have this stuff from, you know, the last time I was recording to do. And yeah, we're gonna start off by going after that bounty in the, um, battlegrounds. I actually did go explore and looking for it earlier, but, uh, the side I was like, I, I need to get into apparently wasn't opened up because the Kuma were in the lead. I'm hoping if we go back now, the fairies will be in the lead, so I can actually, you know, get that job out of the way. Um, the battlegrounds are kind of annoying for hunt missions because of that. I mean, if the right side isn't in the lead, you know, until you get access to the cannons, there's no way to actually get into the other's territory to go looking for them. Which makes hunting them down really annoying. Like, even if it's in the center battlegrounds, they can still get cut off if the Kuma are in the lead, if it's behind them. Because if you get closer to their territory, they start putting in, you know, blockers to stop you. Is this a mysterious seed? I'd love that. No, it's an uni. Ah, eh, screw you, game. That's useless. I mean, I can throw out the enemy, I suppose, but it doesn't do that much damage. Ugh. That just blows. Yes. Enter the battlegrounds, and hopefully we have the right people in the lead so I actually can get some work done. Because I'd hate to have to sit there, you know, and just wait for time to pass so they switch who's in the lead. Because I forget if it's, uh, how many times you've gone in determines, uh, who's in the lead, or if it's, uh, based on, you know, the time on the clock. Both are kind of annoying. And I can't even use, a sh use the shop here yet. Not that I probably have a lot of money anyway, but, you know, it would be nice to check out the shop and see what's in there. But it's not open yet. Okay, keep going this way. Yeah, I suppose I could make money by selling water. Ah, damn it, the Kumar's still in the lead. So it's gotta be time-based. So I'm gonna have to kill time and do nothing while I wait. Oh man. I mean, I could go hunting monsters, I guess, but that just used up my, uh, bonus energy. Like, damn. Yeah, I know there's a watchtower up ahead. And we'll have a big battle here eventually, I'm sure. Ah. Well, it's back here. Why didn't they just mark it on my map, damn it? I thought they did that with this game, but apparently not. I, I guess I, I for just forgot the dangerous. exact location, damn. Maybe I should have read it more carefully. Oh, no weaknesses there, huh? And this guy's not undead, so I can't really use that to my advantage. And we haven't done enough chains yet. Okay. Well, we don't have enough left for a Ma Storm. Well, we could do this. I don't know if it's really going to put the sleep reliably. But I'll take a crack at it. It's going to wake up as soon as it gets hit, but hey. It'll push it back a little bit. A mind bomb? Why are you lowering his intelligence? That doesn't do anything for you. Here, eat some ice, will you? Okay, let's just uh, straight up hit him, I guess. Oh, stealing my move, huh? Well, no. Special move! Here I go! I need more burst energy. Oh, well, guess we're gonna have to go the old school way here. Oh, cool. You're targeting the character that can easily heal. So no one cares. I mean, she's slow, but not slow enough to matter. Um, let's see. Windmill. Here I go! Getting us closer. I really need a healing move, don't I? Well, we'll yeah. toss you a heal jar. Gotta keep you in the game. Eh, that'll push us back a little bit. Oh, damn, he got put to sleep. <laughs> All over time, huh? Well, that's not gonna help me too much. Poison the enemy. 
Well, he doesn't have resistance to poison. So that might ironically work. I think I'll use a cure jar here. After all, I'll put closer to my real goal. Oh, I could flame our lightning rod him. It's not going to be very helpful, though. Yeah, like I said, Unis just aren't very valuable. Uni! I'll throw one anyway, why not? Well, that got me into burst. But, he's still gonna go before us. Gosh darn it. Well, we woke up in time to do something. When we get put to sleep again, gosh darn it. Stop putting her to sleep, damn you. You're ruining my plan. Well, here we go, elemental conversion. <sighs> Damn kobold. It's messing with me. So do I get 360, does that mean? Kinda always messes me up when I look at that. Like, I assume that bonus is, you know, on top of what we had there, so gain 360, but I don't know how much kill I had before I started. Oh well, I might as well head back to town. We came what we we did we came here and did what we wanted to do, which was take out the the target of our hunt here. Didn't really pick up any crystals to raise our point score, but, you know, whatever. Now I can turn this bounty for 2,000 gold. I mean, 9,000 is still not a lot of cash, but, you know, it's better than, you know, what we had. Plus, I can always check the board and see if there's any other easy jobs to take care of, too. Like, there may be another hunt target we can go after. That's hopefully in the Grimori, because, you know, I'm, I'm going there anyway to go talk to a ghost, so... Being able to combine that with something I'm already working on would be nice. Well, let's see... All the way to the back, I believe. We gotta report the results of our hunt. Boom. Well, we took care of it. Just go home already, jeez. So rude. But at least we got a healing onk. Okay. Let's go into equipment. Oh, she's already got it equipped. Darn. Of course, I can't read that board. It's not really where you look for the hunt jobs anyway. Okay. Stop the magic pranks. Destroy all magic using kobolds. Uh, darn it. So I can hunt the big one, but I can't hunt the small one? That makes no sense. Oh, uh, whatever. A kunai, huh? Well, I already set myself up to go on this, uh ghost mission. Why can't I get in the center? Jeez. <sighs> I mean, the mechanical staff ain't that great of a find either, but I'll still take it over helping out Gon for a kunai. I'm like, your dinky little knife isn't even worth talking about. But yeah, I can hunt down a one kobold magician, but I have to hunt down a couple of them. The game's like, no. Like, that's not fair. They're even weaker than the one we had to fight, because that one gets bonuses, because it's meant to be like a main hunt target. It's much more stronger than, you know, the regular magic kobolds. Oof, like, I could easily curb stomp those guys. Uh, we're here from the guild. It's about time. Because of you, I've lost 5 minutes and 29 seconds of precious research time. Jeez. Oh, I'm, a uh, so sorry? Forgive, I don't have much time, so I'll make this quick. I'm currently writing an essay about the existence of ghosts in Alter Worlds. You guys ever seen a ghost in an Alter World? Well, we've seen one. Uh, I can only obtain absolute proof by seeing with my very own eyes. 
Now here's the point. It's not asking you to guide and ask me through an alter world. Present the rewards to the guild already, so how about it? Eh, I kind of have to accept the... Jeez, you stop cutting us off? You're so rude, man! Yeah, I know about it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When something comes up, I'll talk to you. And I'll see you later. A very, very rude man. No, he really didn't. It is, huh? Can't kind of worry about going with him. Well, we don't have a choice. We're going. Yep. Shall we get going then? I'm expecting a prompt response. Jeez. This man is such a massive tool. Or at the le very least, a completely rude jerk. Well, let's keep moving. Though I honestly don't know why th he thought we'd be the best guides for this. But, you know, whatever. Of course, the real question is, can I remember how to get to the library? You know, without getting lost. Take you out. I can hope they drop some eyes, man. Ah, damn, I missed. Shoot. You're up against me. Well, um, Ice Storm. Because it's free. Uh, do your worst, man. Hey. Eh, that barely even hurt. Is that truly your best? I feel insulted. Take you out. That way you can't surprise me with any bombs, damn it. Okay. Well, trying to lower our burst gauge, but didn't really do enough damage to make it work. I'm hoping this will push me over and we can get a bonus. Haha! <laughs> I mean, I'm not going to be able to profit off it because I didn't get any hits in the bonus state, but... At the very least, I now have more energy. You know, if only we get into an inevitable tough fight. Perhaps. I'm not exactly going to go out of my way to, you know, jump anybody here. Get back here. I need to convert you into items, damn it. I can't resist a free kill. Damn, that was a bit close. Okay, we'll pick up some time and grab some more poison mushrooms. Okay. Only. Yeah, damn. Everyone here keeps giving me shrooms. I'm not Mario. I don't need shrooms, damn it. That's not the source of my power. It is the source of all my recovery, though. Which you know, sounds bad. When you put it that way, I guess. Like, what's the secret to your recovery? I eat lots and lots of shrooms. Like, isn't that a bad thing? Like, I don't know. Okay, I think we gotta go this way. I wanna say we go this way. And then I have to go up that other stair or down it. And damn, we missed. Let's end this quickly. Weak, huh? Well, I guess I can take advantage of quite a few things on this. I'm hoping we get a shifty eye for killing it. After all, that would be really convenient. Okay, are we going to get healed or hurt? That missed. No one cares. Yeah, we'll be slightly worse off than we were before, but whatever. I'm not super worried about, you know, the gauge right now. I mean, we only have to get one into the library to meet Pamela. We don't have to really do anything else here. It's not like I gotta face off against a tough enemy here. 
Okay. We need to go this way. Now she allow us to get to the stairs. Get back here so I can kill you, damn it. <sighs> Sometimes, you know, they just move ever so slightly out of reach, I swear. And this way. Yep, library. It is close by, at least. Damn it. Oh, we did kit before it touched us. We got some shifty eyes, I like that. I can actually use those to my advantage. Now, let's see. Seems we made it safely. I appreciate it. Do you? Well, then let me begin my investigative operations. After all, there's a limit to how long I can stay in the Alter Worlds. Either way, when we return to town, I shall see you later. And then instantly, like, freaks out, right? Yeah, escort missions suck, man. They're very tiring. I suppose we will have to listen to his ramblings again. Hmm. Probably amazing collection of books. I would like to look through them if I had the time. I mean, what do they cover? My current bar is to verify the existence of this ghost. Yeah, my question is, are they fiction books or what? And freaks out. A new visitor? You're a g ghost Yes, yes I am. It's been a while since I've spooked anyone with my appearance. Happy, huh? <laughs> yes. Except in Atelier RS2 where she's not dead, so she has a different name. Why are you the librarian anyway? You just like to move the books around, drive everyone else crazy. Yes, Quattro Alberto Winna. <laughs> I'm researching ghosts and... Zave was... Oh, oh yes. Do some research on you? What kind of research? Ugh, blush, huh? I guess we're taking this as a... Dating sort of thing? I don't get it. Oh, promise that, huh? Careful, does it defy the laws of quantum mechanics? And fallen in love. <laughs> what is it? It isn't, huh? At least he wasn't staring at your chest, though I suppose that's why the teddy bear's there, right? Uh a completely flustered guy, I take that much to be true. <laughs> well, at least we don't have to stay here any longer, but I still want to grab a few free items. Boom. Yeah, he's already left. How he did that, I don't know. I, mean, I guess he used the two town option, but why? Not really. My question is, what are in all these books? Like, seriously. There are, like, thousands of them in this place. Whatever, G. Don't care, G. It's like the pre-version of Dude, man. Well, let's get out of here. And go, uh, report our success, I suppose. The question is, I can't remember if I have to go talk to Winna again, or if I can just go to the guild and collect my reward. <sighs> it's been a while. Honestly, I didn't think doing just a hunt mission in this would take so damn long. <sighs> of course, to get the true ending, we gotta do all the boot missions. Joy. And yeah, I'll probably still go for the true ending. Even though I know how to avoid it. Because I guess I just have to do as many boot missions as necessary to get that. Darn it, that's too early. <sighs> yeah, I could technically farm that and sell them for 99. But 
That's not really going to make me that much money. I mean, it's a way, just not a very good way. Come on. Let's go uh, complete our job, I guess. Like, I think they said we had to talk to him again. I am not looking forward to it. Because he's probably going to be just as rude as before. Or not. Well, now. Winna? Huh. Can you hear me? Winna? It's you guys. Please don't scare me like that. You said your name, but you didn't respond. It seems quite different today. Is something wrong? Not really. I was just thinking. Say, do you guys go to the Grimori Castle often? Yeah, our job kind of requires us to. Envious, huh? Huh? Uh, never mind, forget what I just said. Uh, yes, you're for the quest. Thank you very much. Yes. He's fallen in love. With a ghost. Weird. Then again, I suppose we did see that in Ghostbusters with a, a ghostly uh, blowjob, so, you know, whatever works for you guys. At any rate, we get ourselves a mechanical staff recipe, and we're now rank 5. So we can get back to Haggle's job, I believe. Well, now... Another's arrived. Dang. Gon's gonna have to wait. Well, arrived on the fairy side, it looks like. Well, now, that's gonna be fun. Why has that one got a giant boomerang? Is that his weapon of choice? I'm going to wring the crap out of you! Ah uh, yes, we finally get our third character. After this is all said and done. Well, now... Well, we've ranked up! I know, on such a hard mission, too. I'm so tired. We've done so many quests in such a short time. I don't want to lose to those sisters. Eh, near do they. Let's go meet with Haggle. Aww, can't you just let me rest a little while? No, because those sisters are, like, right behind us. I'm sorry we made you wait. Have the other two... Nope, you got here first. All right, let's hear the details of this quest. Oh, hey! And, like I said, right behind us. Ah, uh, so close. You're just a couple seconds too late. Well, look at the bright side. You can take better jobs now. No, damn it. Let's go now. But, sis... Forget it. Oh... Sis? You said your name was Edge? Yeah? Why are you asking? Yeah. I'll make sure you pay for this. Why? <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> and why do you have such a big headband piece? Like, seriously. <laughs> she seemed pretty mad. Well, it's really not your fault. Anyway, about my hammer. That's right. So what's going on? 
Someone stole it. Yesterday, I can't seem to find it. I wouldn't just leave it somewhere, so someone had to have stolen it. Yeah, why would you want to steal a blacksmith's hammer? I just don't really I'm get it. Drinking the night before, <laughs> I don't remember coming home. I'm sure the hammer was right here. Were there any signs of a break-in? Well, the doors were locked. Interesting. Was wrong with the windows or anything? Please, I don't really even care who done it. Please, just find my hammer. Okay, we'll be sure to find it. We'll be right back. I'm counting on you. So, what should we do? Well, obviously we go to the bar Maybe first. The tavern is the perfect place to gather info. Isn't it always? He did say he was drinking. The tavern? Sure. I mean, where else would you go to get plastered? Well, that'll do for this episode. Next time, I guess we'll follow up on getting that hammer and uh, taking on our next boss. Until then, see ya.